right, Sony's Marvel Universe expands with Morbius. Is it worth checking out? Let's get into my thoughts on this one. So this movie is set in the same universe as the two Venom movies that have come out. This is also a Spider-Man villain, and it follows Dr. Michael Morbius, played by Jared Leto, as he tries to heal himself from a rare blood condition. One day, he finds a cure, and basically, this cure... While it does make him look better, it pretty much turns into a vampire. Sometimes. <laughs> it, it's it's weird. It's it's a little confusing, I know, but don't worry. I typically don't like to mention, like, Rotten Tomatoes in my reviews. But it's worth noting that this is getting pretty bad reviews. At last time I checked, this is at least, like, a 17% on Rotten Tomatoes. Do I think it's that bad? No, not really, actually. Jared Leto, who plays the title character, has been in the spotlight for a while, especially for his infamous method acting uh, moments, especially when he played Joker. But here, it's... he did okay. It's really weird seeing him be somewhat normal in this movie, but that's just me. I do think the highlight here is uh, Matt Smith right over there. Uh, I'm not gonna spoil it, because I, I'm just not going to, but I think he's by far the best part of this movie. I also think the visual effects are actually pretty okay, too. Surprisingly, there are parts of this where I was pretty blown away by some of the effects. However, it does really get hurt by the editing in this. It really seems like that this was supposed to be a two-hour-plus movie, because this is a relatively short movie, and... It really, it gets crushed down to about an hour and 45 minutes, and it does not help at all. I also think the side plot with the two uh, detectives in this movie, played by Tyrese Gibson, and I actually forget the other actor's name, uh, it didn't do much for me either, but really just, I don't fully understand why this is getting hated on as much. Is it a perfect movie? God, no. It, actually, I would say... This is one of the less entertaining of the Marvel movies that have come out recently. But is, is it still fun? I think so. I had a good time with it. Will I ever watch it again, though? Maybe a little bit down the line, but I don't really have any desire to watch it now again. Basically, this movie is a huge missed opportunity. There was a lot of potential for this movie to be great, but I really feel like they just missed it here. Morbius didn't work for me.